Hey, so here we are. This is Paul over at the uh, Loofer Ranch, and uh, right now um, we're in Murphy, North Carolina. It's two minutes, 29 seconds. It's uh, August 21st, 2017, and we're in the full eclipse here just at, uh, what, about 2.30. So I'm going to let the film roll because I want you to see what the lighting is going to be like as it, we go completely eclipse now. Um, the moon is on this one. It's not like in some other parts of the country um, uh, where you're just going to see a partial. This is, this is going to be a full here, and we're going to be full for about maybe uh, two minute, two and a half minutes, something like that. So I'm going to continue to film so you get a chance to see uh, what it's going to look like. It's really weird with sunglasses on. It right, right, right now, um, and it's uh, let's see, it's gotta put my glasses on to be able to see here. It's uh, 2 minutes and 29 seconds, and uh, I'm sorry, not 2 minutes, it's, there you go, it just went to 2.30 Eastern Standard Time. So, uh, what's supposed to happen is it's supposed to be dark enough to where we'll be able to see the stars. And uh, I've seen this one time happen years ago in San Diego, uh, out in California, and it's been a number of years. I've seen partials before, but uh, this one... Is, uh, should be really awesome. So we're looking down a valley. It's about maybe a mile long uh, on the edge of uh, the ranch uh, right now here at the Lufa Ranch and we're waiting to see what happens. So, so yesterday was a pretty special day. We had um, one of our ewes uh, gave birth to twins. We have a little, uh, little uh, male, a little female, a little boy and girl uh, sheep. And uh, so I took a little bit of video of the lambs earlier so you get a chance to see them uh, a few minutes ago uh, as, the, as the light's changing. So let's see what happens here. Yeah, I can tell you as I take off, uh, as I take off my glasses, and, uh, and look around, it is just really bizarre. Now they've got the special glasses that you're supposed to use. Uh, you know, in this case, you're never supposed to look at the sun, uh, but uh, in the solar eclipse, you can really cook your eyes. You can end up permanently damaging them, even though it doesn't seem as bright, the rays still come through. So I can definitely tell right now, uh, the lighting has changed. It's, uh, it's 231. It continues to get darker. It's really bizarre, and it's it is odd. It's almost it's not quite like the sun is going down. Like when the sun sets, there's a different hue to uh, all the foliage around. And uh, so, of course, with the sunglasses, it's a little bit different as well. But it's almost like I can't really use my sunglasses now because it's a little bit too dark, and I can't really see very much. So uh, take a look here, and I'm gonna step behind the camera. So you can see a little bit better. Yeah, so right now it's uh, about 2.32 and it continues to get, looks like, darker. So Amy and, and some of the other guests, they've got the special glasses and they're up uh, in another place on the farm and they're looking uh, at it through uh, through the special lenses so they can see it. I don't uh, have them with me and uh, I, I wanted to kind of spend time just looking at this now. And this is really bizarre. It's um, It just got even darker now. Whoa. This is amazing. So right now it's 2.33 and I believe the total is going to be at 2.34. Uh, I would say we're almost there. If, if I'm wrong, yeah, it's, it's going even darker. This is crazy. I might not be able to actually film this, so I'll just keep the audio going. Yeah, it's completely going dark. This is bizarre. So I'm going to keep rolling now. Wow. I'm going to keep rolling. Yep. Okay, so I asked my son Mitchell if he would please beep <laughs> when it was at full. 
this is absolutely full and I would say like right now would be similar to uh, you know it's gonna get dark it um, the Sun is set and it's almost to the point where you just absolutely can't see that's the way it is right now it is crazy so I'm gonna keep rolling this just so that you have the audio and then we're gonna see over the next few minutes we're gonna go back to the way it was before so I'm just gonna keep rolling. This is a lot longer video than I would normally uh, shoot. If you uh, follow our channel here at pauloriente.com, there's a lot of different uh, types of videos. We do everything from, um, from life on the farm. Some of our um, videos are on gardening, on uh, the loofah ranch and our loofah sponge farming here. Uh, how to grow sunflower seeds. There's some culinary things on there. There's some acoustic guitar. Uh, music. Um, you'll see some uh, wildlife camera videos and different wildlife that we film. Uh, so always, uh, you know, something a little bit different for you. We've got uh, about 330 different episodes right now. Uh, if you if you're a martial artist, if you're a boxer, there's some great instructionals on the speed bag. Uh, there's one um, that you'll see uh, the 85 year old man. Uh, rips the speed bag. That's my father uh, that we videoed um, a few months ago on his 85th birthday. That has been uh, a clip of that has been used by Juke and Media on the People Are Awesome 2017 Martial Arts Edition. That has over 40 million views uh, across the world. And we're just uh, do you know we like doing different things, and this is certainly different and something um, you know that some people may never see. Uh, a, a full solar eclipse is happening every year in different parts around the world. A lot of times it falls uh, in an area over the ocean, so it doesn't get seen by many people. Uh, but this happens to be in Murphy, North Carolina, and uh, so there was a number of people that came to town just to get a chance to experience this. So this is a pretty, uh, pretty special time for us. Now the light is starting to come back, I notice here, so let me... Uh, take a look and see what time it is okay so it's 2 36 p.m. Uh, that's Eastern Standard Time and this is unbelievable but the Sun is starting to come back absolutely amazing here it comes so this is almost like a sunrise like if the Sun is coming up and you're like uh, you know up early in the morning and you're starting to see it happen but it's happening really faster than you would ever normally see it. This is crazy cool. So I'm glad I left the, the camera running. Um, we've had a little bit of a busy day today. I wasn't sure if I was gonna get a chance to come down and film this for y'all, but uh, I'm glad that I, I did. I'm gonna move the camera around so you can kind of see how the lighting has changed and we'll just kind of pan over here and you can start to see, unbelievable, it's starting to come back. And I started filming, um, let's see, I guess I've been running for about 8 minutes and 25 seconds. And just over that 8 minutes, look how it has changed. Just crazy. I, I have to say, I've seen a lot of different things um, happen here on the farm. Um, I don't know if, uh, if you haven't had a chance to see it. Uh, look at uh, breaking news, strange object falls in North Carolina sky. That was last September. We had just a bizarre thing fall uh, while I was out uh, watering uh, the loofah field. And uh, I captured it. It looked to me like some kind of space trash may be falling. Um, take a look at that one. Uh, we have Miracle at the Loofah Ranch. Um, you want to take a look at that one. You want to see God's hand on something miraculous. Last year, uh, our loofah crop was surrounded seven times by uh, frost but it never uh, touched and damaged our field until the eighth time and it took the whole entire field. I mean, it's just amazing. Um, so I hope you stop by and, and visit the channel and take a look at some of our other videos. Uh, we're at right now, it's uh, 2.38. It looks like the sun is coming back to what, it's not quite normal uh, lighting because it's gonna take a little bit before it to completely make its pass. and. I'll probably have to go back in and edit and make some corrections, but I think it's about an hour and a half it takes to, to from the beginning until the end uh, when it's completely uh, uh, completely um, away from the, the full uh, eclipse. So 
uh, the moon slides over, touches where the uh, sun is, and then eventually we, we had the full uh, eclipse just moments ago, and then eventually it's working its way to the other side, and, and, uh, and it'll just be like a normal, normal day. But this is incredible, because just in a matter of minutes, uh, go back and rewind and look at it again. We were looking at, you know, just like kind of a normal day, and then all of a sudden uh, it starts to uh, fade the lighting until we're just pitch black. And I know the cam stopped working as far as probably uh, uh, being able to focus on anything, but take a look at the period of time. All of a sudden it starts coming back, and this is incredible because this is a, about where the lighting was when I first started filming a few minutes ago. So, again, it's a little bit longer video. It's going to take me a little bit longer to get this one uploaded. I want to get it uh, up uh, and out to you so you get a chance to see what it was like from the Loof Ranch in Murf, North Carolina. So thanks again for sharing, liking our channel, and all the nice comments. We really appreciate it. God bless you, and we'll see you soon.